Hi, welcome. The last video I made was rather technical. It was looking at the DWM, the suckless from them, and comparing it with ours. So this is certainly the place where you should have a look. And um, there are patches that you can check out and then try out. Our Steven has checked them all out and he knows what are the best. And we do, want, do not want to just fill everything up with patches. We have carefully uh, looked at what to take and what not to take. And one of the things we do like in most of our tiling winner managers are the caps. As you see, we have caps. But some of them, some may be thinking, well, first of all, you don't want gaps. Secondly, it's too not, not big enough. You want more gaps. So let's try the gaps. Why not, right? Let's figure it out. Super shift enter. You know already if you watched uh, the other videos that here it is where you need to go. This is our Arco DWM. And you need to find gaps. Now I have in the meantime installed an application, the Platinum Searcher, a RIP. I have installed this guy. The last thing that I did was the Platinum Searcher bin. When have I type RIP gaps? Oh, sorry, <laughs> PT gaps, right? This is where the word gaps comes, is, is available. So we've installed a patch called DWM full gaps. It's in here, gaps between the windows. It's in there, it's in the config H and the dev H. Both of them have it. You see, so we could get, could have a look at this one, config dev H, and then open sublime text. Look for gaps. Here it says gap X, gap BX, right? Uh, so this one, this line, gaps between windows, line number five. And there are more if you want to have more gaps, the minus, the equal key, and so on. With shift or without shift, super shift, equal. Now that's key bindings. What we want to do is make it bigger. So let's really make it big, right? 20. And then you save, and then you might think, okay, control X, or super X, sorry, super X, log out. Just wanna show you something, which I'm not gonna show every single time. And then you say, Eric, nothing changed. Yeah, nothing will ever change if you do it this way. What you need to do is realize DWM is actually an application. So which DWM? That's it, use a local bin DWM. That's the thing that we're working now, that we see, we're looking at, that's DWM. And this here is just a setting that's not yet applied in this package. It's not in here yet. Okay, so that means I need to install this thing. First you make it, and then sudo make install it. And then you do it like this. Super X. Log out, log in, control T, control T, and you see there is no difference. What did we do? Wrong, right? Okay, let's have a look again. What do we have here? We have two of them, this guy and that guy. What uh, shall we compare? So you, if you want to compare, you need to have this uh, melt application. So, okay, so this means when I'm working on the dev, nothing happens. When I change this guy to here, both of them are the same. So this guy, config H, that's the new thing that has been changed and now saved. Okay, will that change things? Make, make, install. And it says permission denied, why? What did we forget? It wants to write to a part where you can't write. Pseudo make install. So we all make this mistake just by being fast. Just remember you're writing to a particular place that's protected. It's not your home directory anymore. Pseudo. Super X, log out. How <laughs> will it look? 20 gaps. Oh my God, right? Super C, by con key, control T, control T, control T. Nothing is working. This is just rubbish. Go back, back to the config, back to Oracle DWM, 
back to config h uh yeah let's open with compare maybe easier although it's too small so let's do this guy sublime text Ooh, there you are so 20 save and let's see if i save this as well both of them are five nah safe okay let's check it out compare are both 20 20 20 okay cool now we're gonna make it make and sudo make almost forgot it again sudo make install off it goes now super shift r is what we use sometimes to restart our dwm our um, tiling window manager but in this case i rather like to log out and log in always and there you go i know what we've done in the past there might have made an error i don't know what it is but we saved it now this time it, it is saved and um, let's yeah fi let's find an, an thing that's a little bit brighter so you see all the way around we have what did i take i think 20 pixels and that's it but it's not that simple it's not like i'm going to change the number reload and that's done no you have to make and build the package again and again and again now let's let's do this one just this one and let's take 50 for example save and the other one just to show you again and myself if you take this guy this one is 50 and that one is 5 for example which one is is applied that's a just uh, oops that's the only thing i want to show config def h 5 okay config h config h where are you here you are it's 50 5 and 50 gonna be different then eh? well we surely see which one is applied make sudo make install and off we go log out oops l i was pressing m super c control t Ooh. So it's clear which one is applied. And actually it's not that bad. Now 50, I thought it would be rubbish, but it's not that bad. Certainly not if you want to just make, make a beautiful screenshot. C matrix does not exist. Pseudo Pac-Man, actually we have a new one. C uh, minus S, C, X, X or something. Ooh, too much possibility. Something like that. Yay, that's it. And also a very nice one. I like the C matrix, but this guy is also not that bad. You can type your own text in there if you want to. But then finally everything kicks in and there you go. Virtual box, right? It holds somewhere and then it continues. You don't see that on real metal. Point is point was for the last thing that I did that one of these two files are applied and which one the config h is applied that one had 50 not this guy so this config def should be seen as some kind of backup backup thing if you say okay we're gonna keep the five as as default then this thing is is um, kept as default there as as this kind of backup but this guy is actually used for the programmation, for the creation, creation of the voila, of the application. Back to the normal look, one more time. Then the video is at its end. Sudo make install and topic A. Then we go out. This won't work. We'll see if that's possible to work. But um, 
it's an application, right? We need to go out and into so that the application gets started again. So the the super shift R is probably not going to be. Oops, sorry, it's not going to be possible. Control T, Control T, Control T. Five is great. Five is great. All right, there you go, guys. Um, this was about gaps and changing some things. Cheers.